Hi guys, welcome to my most tutorials. Today we're going to be looking at hard fractional equations, but they're not that hard. Okay, you just need to pay attention, okay, to how we go about these ones. So today we have 5x plus 9 all divided by x squared minus 2x minus 3 minus 2x over 3 minus x is equal to x over x plus 1. Okay, so for us to solve this one, we need to first uh, factorize uh, this one which is x squared minus 2x minus 3. Let's factorize it quickly. Uh, if we say x squared times uh, minus 3, we'll get minus 3x squared. Okay. Let's look for two numbers. When we multiply, they will give us, uh, we multiply them, they'll give us minus 3x squared. But, excuse me, when we add or subtract them, they'll give us minus 2. So in this case, it's going to be minus 3x and a positive x. Okay. So meaning to say, uh, when you, after factorizing x squared minus 2x minus 3, our, our denominator is supposed to be x minus 3 and x plus 1, okay? Hopefully you guys still remember how to factorize, okay? So now, the first fraction is going to be 5x plus 9 over x minus 3, x plus 1, minus 2x over 3 minus x, okay, it's 3 minus x, equal to x over x plus 1, okay. So now the second step, we are going to multiply by the common denominator. As we can see here, it's x minus 3, x plus 1, x plus 1, and then this side is 3 minus x, okay. 3 minus x and x minus 3. So what I'm going to do to this one to make it look the same as x minus 3, we're going to multiply this second fraction by a negative, okay? When we multiply it by a negative, we are going to end up having minus, minus uh, 2x over x minus 3. It will become x minus 3, okay? It's going to be x minus 3. Our denominator there is going to be x minus 3 equal to x over x plus 1. This side we've got 5x plus 9 over x minus 3, x plus 1, okay? So minus and a minus are going to give us a positive uh, 2x over x minus 3. So this is going to be 5x plus 9 over x minus 3, x plus 1, plus 2x over x minus 3 equals to x over x plus 1. Hopefully you guys are following. And then from this stage, let's multiply everything by the common denominator. In this case, it's x minus 3 and x plus 1, okay? We are multiplying everything by x minus 3 and x plus 1. I'll put a dot here, x minus 3, x plus 1, x minus 3, x plus 1, x minus 3, x plus 1. Okay, hopefully you guys can see that. So for the first one, x minus 3 and x plus 1 are going to cancel out. We are going to remain, uh, okay, let me do this. We are going to remain with 5x plus 9 plus, in this case, x minus 3 and x minus 3 are going to cancel out. We remain with 2x, open bracket, x plus 1 equal to, x plus 1 is going to cancel out with x plus 1. We remain with x open bracket x minus 3 okay so now this is uh, 5x plus 9 plus 2x squared plus 2x is equal to x squared minus 3x okay now let's group them together we have 2x squared let's bring the x squared this side go to minus x squared and then we have got plus 5x plus 2x. If we bring the 3x this side, it's going to be plus 3x plus a 9. It's just a 9. Only 9. Yes, it's only 9. Equals to 0. 2x squared minus x squared is x squared. 5 plus 2 plus 3. 5 plus 2, 7 plus 3 is 10x. So it's x squared plus 10x. 
plus 9 equals to 0. Okay, now we can factorize this one. 9x squared, two numbers will multiply them, they'll give us uh, 9x squared, but when you add or subtract them, they'll give us 10. In this case, it's going to be x plus 9 and x plus 1. Okay, x plus 1 and x plus 9 is equal to 0. So x is equal to minus 1 or minus 9. Hopefully you guys are following. So what I simply did there, I took the plus 1 that side and then it became negative 1. The plus 9 that side and it became uh, minus 9. Okay, hopefully you guys benefited from watching this video. For more videos like this, please don't forget to subscribe and also to share with your friends. Thank you.